Chester Zoo are calling on the government to change its funding criteria for zoos as they face a £5 million shortfall. They say they welcome the news the application for the government's Zoo Animals Fund has been extended. However, they say the eligibility criteria is far too restrictive, while any support for conservation and education work is completely excluded. Earlier this year, the Department for Environment, Food and Rural Affairs opened a £100 million fund to support zoos and aquariums who are struggling with the impact of the pandemic. Organisations are invited to apply for grants of up to £730,000 with the new deadline of January 29th, 2021. Initially, organisations need to be down to just six weeks of reserves in order to be eligible for support. However, this was changed to 12 weeks in August. The Northwest Attraction said this effectively requires a zoo to be on the verge of bankruptcy before it can get any access to funding. I, I wouldn't be doing my job if I allowed the zoo to get within 12 weeks of bankruptcy without taking on, as we have done, for example, large loans or other measures in which to put in place. So actually extending the deadline is welcome, but it won't make any difference to, to, to the vast majority of the sector. Um, unless we can actually sort of renegotiate on the, uh, the criteria for the fund. It's really heartwarming to see the amount of letters and support we get from, from local people. It's unbelievable, actually, how, how much people love Chester Zoo and get behind it. For me as a CEO, it's just fantastic. So we are that to people. We are culturally really important. We also do some really crucial work overseas uh, with, with our conservation outreach work and with our education work in zoos. But we're also visitor attraction and a charity and a large business. So kind of all those things, I think, get complicated in terms of what we are as an organisation and probably don't help in the long run um, in terms of what sectors we fit in.